Look, it's simple. All you have to say is, hi, I took a blood test and I wanted my results back. Got it? <sighs> Hello, can I help you? I want my blood back. Huh? What happens to nitrogen when the sun rises? It becomes daytrogen. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, that got me. That got me. I'm going to my room. Good night, Trigen. Sleep tight, Trigen. Don't let the bed bugs bite, Trigen. <laughs> <laughs> well, if it isn't Logan Sanders. But it is me. No, it's. Your manipulative tricks won't work on me. People say I have a unique way of lighting up the room! It's called arson, and those people are witnesses. Oh, how much would a trip to Spain cost? It depends where you live. For example, if you live in Spain, it's free. Mmm. All right. What would you like your cake to say? Do we want a talking cake? What would you say if one day I came home with uh, six puppies? What's in the box? What's in the box, Patton? I think you know. Hey, are you busy? And writing Star Trek fan fiction does not count. Oh, ha, ha, ha. I finished it last week. What's going on? You shouldn't be using a straw. I know. It's bad for the environment or whatever. No, it's just a weird way to eat spaghetti. <laughs> I love sleepovers. This isn't a sleepover, you're in the hospital. Then why do I have this nightgown? That's a hospital gown, truth or dare? Dare. It's a little muggy out today. I swear to God, if I go outside and all our mugs are on the lawn, I'm leaving. Do you have any shaving cream? No, I don't like the way that it tastes. Wait, you eat shaving cream? No. Why would I eat it if I don't like the way that it tastes? It's a white flag, Roman, and you may as well start waving it. The only thing I will be waving is your decapitated head on a stick in front of your weeping mother! Good lord. Hey, can you grab us a table? Sure. Start the car! Do you take constructive criticism? <laughs> yeah, what's up? Mm. Mm. I like Eminem. I prefer Skittles. No, I meant the wrapper. You eat the wrapper? <sighs> hey, kiddos, did you know a group of fish is called a family? Yeah, and a group of lions is called a pride. A group of crows is called a murder. And a group of people is called a migraine. <laughs> What are you doing in here? Who are you? Who let you in? Just kidding. I did. Welcome! And color me oh so grateful for your pocketbooks. I mean, support. You've just bought yourself access to some of the things Thomas and his team would just as well keep to themselves. Very selfish indeed. And while I do admire that sort of thing, some things are better left un- Cumbered from being sold to the highest bidders. Seriously, guys, thank you so much. I, I Thomas, can't Thomas, begin Thomas, Thomas. to... Please, I've got this. Oh, all right. Anyway, enjoy the secrets that I hoard in my corridor of stored rewards. I want you to turn to the person to your left. Now to the person to your right. By the end of this class, one of those students should be able to spot my phone. I lost it again. I can't find it anywhere. Now, buddy, you gotta do some reading before you have your snacks. That shirt with those shoes, sweetie. Come and get those chicken nuggets. Why do people celebrate Pie Day? By eating pie. Pie is a seemingly never-ending, non-repeating number. A transcendental number. Archimedes is constant. And with it, a multitude of geometric values can be determined. A concept such as this is more delicious than any known confection. <coughs> Crofters, where?
Okay, I cannot stress this enough. Seriously, it is so fun to stress this out. We get it. <laughs> Thank you all so much for the birthday messages today. I did not have this on my calendar and was not looking forward to it at all. It would definitely not be my thing to celebrate someone's first introduction into a series, but I'm not going to complain. More cake for me. And juice. I will find my way, I can go the distance, I don't care how far, if I can be true. Oh my gosh, it's Patton's birthday tomorrow. little of behind the scenes making of the most recent Sanders slides because it got delayed and delayed not only because Joan was in surgery but also because we were taking on a new approach to this video like in the lying video there's the stage in the fitting in video we used Harry Potter in this one we wanted to approach the video with two methods of storytelling that Joan had proposed they even made a little demo to show me what they were thinking about for this video hello I am Logan Sanders and this is my list of points I'm not sure why I only wrote list in all capital letters so just try to ignore that point number one this is an important point it kind of speaks for itself really Point number two, this point is very important. It cannot be stressed enough. Point number three, always remember this point. There, I think I've made my points. But the point of life can't just be effort for effort's sake. That effort should go towards reaching some sort of peak. And it was so impressive, I was like, we have to try this. Joan's mind is amazing. And so for this project, I decided to do a little vlogging to give you guys some insight as to what went into making the video possible. We got the art from a fantastic artist, shout out, because not only did she make all of the illustrations for this video, super pleasure to work with. She's also responsible for the nice illustrated posters that are available at the store. Joan wanted like a little prince, stylistic, Illustrations for Roman? Yeah. Like, folders and folders full of stuff from her. And this cute uh, little elephant. I love that. I haven't even seen that yeah, yet. It's gonna be watering uh, this An plant. elephant? That is the cutest thing. It's gonna be watering this plant. Then this is gonna sprout beneath it and knock it over. And so what Joan has to do, they've been delivered in transparencies, but Joan needs to make them look like cutouts, like yeah. a piece of paper. Yeah. So Joan is going through this uh, process on Photoshop where they just kind of create jagged edges edges by doing this line effect yeah. and then masking out the black, like taking that layer out. And make it invisible. And then what and then I do... And gave the white a texture like paper. Yeah, and then I'll uh, add a tiny bevel so that it looks like it, like maybe it's like a thick piece of paper. There's so much that even like went over my head when they first showed me the illustration and then like seeing what goes behind every single thing. <laughs> this there's, is that one moment that happens when Roman like says riches. It's all about achieving ultimate fame, riches, and living in a mansion hidden by a waterfall on the side of a mountain. I feel like a lot of the work for this project feels very much like that thing from <laughs> from Parks and Rec. Oh, oh yeah! yeah. <laughs> the little stand yeah. in the plate. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> so much effort for like these five second clips. He's dedicated his time for three days making the Logan section. Yeah, I was gonna do those, but then I realized, oh, I can't do everything. Though. I mean, there's only so much that a person recovering from an intrusive surgery can do. Yeah, I love making them, watching them pop up. Nice. Now that's an X axis. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. No, you don't have ha, to fake ha, laugh. Ha, don't ha, humor ha, me. <laughs> Perfect. Look at that beautiful, beautiful work by Terrence. I'm sorry that, that I made it harder, it. but I definitely think these the colored lines would work better than the gray one. Yeah. Hard work pays off. Basically, I had one layer of white paper, and I okay. 
<laughs> I erased around these. <laughs> I erased. Okay, let me add a background so that looks easier. To see. Now I'll just focus on the skull, and then I just erased the uh, painting, and then I erased around it so that I got the skull shape. And I was like, cool. Now I'll use my copy of the white paper. Oh, you have the shadows as a separate animation. Yeah, just so that I could like make them do whatever I wanted. If I wanted the shadows, yeah, that makes to sense. Yeah. See, and what I did for that was I turned down the exposure, turned off the contrast, and turned all these down. Drop the opacity down to 65. Add a Gaussian blur, and then ta-da! <laughs> Since they were both exported in the same Photoshop project that was the same dimensions, I could type in exactly the same position on Premiere, and they would be in the same exact place. Oh, cool. Okay. You'll notice when you watch the video how many days it took some of the characters. Roman, we got done with one night because I was feeling it. I was just feeling really good. I think it definitely comes down to making sure that you are in the right spirits. I think it also makes sense because that Roman, in my interpretation, had something to prove because he wasn't asked to create that game. And so this was nice to kind of like have this opportunity for Logan and Roman to really just kind of go at it. Their constant back and forth is exactly what motivates a person at the same time. Their forces combined leads Thomas down the right path. Logan took three days because we had limited time because that was right after Joan got out of surgery. So you could see like how much time went by even just by looking at the window in the kitchen. The shots with Joan in it and the other friends took place before Joan went into surgery. For Logan pulling Roman into the scene, we used gel in my hair and yes, when you put all the takes together, it's hilarious. For Roman's elastic powers, this is what I saw acting as Logan. Talon was behind the elbow, so they were kind of a human prop. <laughs> And then Joan felt it very important to include that end card scene with Patton and Virgil because Joan felt like that was the one argument that was missing from the video. Yeah, we make the videos to not only be able to support ourselves financially and also to pursue our dreams, but also there is that added factor about helping people and just making people laugh. That's what Joan felt was the piece that was missing from the argument in that video. So that was a really nice way to cap it off. And that was a lot of fun. This was a very long sequence of shooting, but it worked out. By the time that we got done, filming everything that we needed to film. I think we had about 12 or so hours of footage. There was a lot of practice and messed up lines and stuff. I had a lot to cycle through in order to get the best takes. So while I was editing through all the raw footage, Joan and Talon were finishing up the animations. So this was some ingenuity because we didn't know how to format where the heads come in for Frida Kahlo, Bob Ross, and yeah, William Shakespeare. So there was just an idea to take the waterfall and change it gold. There we go, yep. There we go. And those are gonna come in from both ends. Yeah. Oh, see, that looks so good. And then we can move the heads a little higher up in the screen so they're centered. Yeah. Innovation. Yeah. Yay. Finally done with our last slide. <laughs> and it only took three days. And it really will look like it just pops up on the screen. Joan does have a saying, or you don't have a saying, but you learned it from somewhere, where it's like a project can either be fast yeah. and cheap, but it won't be good. Or it could be fast and good, but it won't be cheap. Or it could be good and cheap, but it won't be fast. Yeah. And I feel like that's our category right now. Yeah. Good and cheap is how we operate. Just won't be fast. When they gave them to me, I looked for sound effects that worked for each of the moments. Life is an astronomically unlikely privilege and it should be taken very seriously. So like all of those little pops, I found like progressive pop noises that worked for each of those things. I really actually had a lot of fun, even finding Ferrari sounds. Like I wanted to be accurate with the Ferrari sounds. And your Aunt Patty gifted you a Lamborghini. Found like a simple wow sound by a guy. A millionaire wow. doesn't look very wealthy. And then I found like a crowd that said wow. Standing next to Oprah Winfrey. Every time. So that was all, you know, individually put in, as you can see with the xylophone sounds. We reach a predetermined goal, the danger with pursuing witches. Even down to the marker sounds. So I had a lot of fun with that. And uh, on top of that, I also had fun with the music. So for this video, I felt like I wanted a juxtaposition of the, the different songs that you hear for each of the characters. They have a very specific sound. For Logan's points, I either used music that was electronic or inspired by 8-bit, or I used any song that, uh, you know, in Audio Jungle was labeled as quirky. For Roman, I found anything that was dramatic, action-filled, lots of strings, trailer songs. I get most of my songs from Audio Jungle. For the moment that uh, Thomas tells Logan and Roman that they make a good team, I found a very interesting track that was almost like a combination of symphonic with the 8-bit sound. Joan kind of like deemed it Logan and Roman's kind of fusion song. So I liked that. Uh, so it might be like their new theme, like every character has a theme song, there might be this kind of idea we play with of combining two thematic songs for two characters at once. So that, I guess, will be Logan and Roman's theme song. 
<laughs> and there we go. We posted upload about two hours ago at this point. Yeah. We've just been sitting here looking at comments and reviewing what people think and watching react videos because that's how we do. Yeah, I had gotten Joan a replacement hat for the, the video itself. This is the third one that was is sent in. Sammy Wham and Tunisia? and Tunisia. This is the one to stick. I think this is the keeper. The one that I had purchased was a little too tight. A little tight on my head. It's good to that see an true. orange beanie on your yeah, head again. It works. I was just telling Joan, it's just one of those videos that I think uh, was super nice because I didn't realize how much I enjoyed it until literally the next day watching it for the first time and just feeling myself emotionally invested in the video. I know during the planning we put a lot of emphasis on uh, their actual arguments. Yes. We go story then arguments. Yeah. And this one was more arguments and then fitting no, it to a story. Any story? I don't think the origin of like why Thomas had the dilemma was a little bit okay. like um, an after, like yeah. it wasn't an afterthought but we did have to like, okay how would we come across this It's similar this to my negative thinking in that way I guess. Yeah. So I was like really happy and I'm really excited people really enjoy it. Talent over here. You don't look like a frog. <laughs> Stop it. If anything, you look like a fogged up window because you are steamy. Hey. <laughs> I hope that that gave you some insight into what all went into it. Yeah. Hours and hours of just a lot of time. getting it right. And I'm so happy. It was definitely one of those that I was just like, didn't know how good it was going to look until watching it all back and just being pleasantly, pleasantly surprised. So, cool. Yeah. On to the next one. Yeah. <laughs> Exception, you are the only exception. You are the only exception. You are the only exception. Hey, you, yeah, you, yeah, I'm a shadow on a wall. Shut up for a second. You know Thomas Sanders, that buying guy? He does other stuff now. Good stuff? He likes to think so. Maybe you do too. And if you do, you should pay a visit to my corridor of stored rewards. Has an ominous shadow ever steered you wrong? Also, oh my gosh, it was Virgil's birthday today. Four years! Four years since Virgil was first introduced. Happy birthday to me. And on National Emo Day. Mm. Sup? Hope that you guys are having a good weekend. I'm just chilling now. That skirt was an experience. Andersides figures. Don't see a Janice in there. Don't see one of the best characters out there. Just saying. Everybody. I'm not gonna do the hand thing. It's too much work. Tis I, deceit, Janice. And yes, I've always said tis I, always. I hope that you all are doing so well. I couldn't even get through that sentence. I couldn't even lie about how little I cared about how well you were doing. I mean, who is doing well these days? If you say that you are doing well, you're lying to yourself. A lot of you out there have requested that I take on the game Among Us. I hear that it has a lot of deception involved in it. So I thought, why the hell not? <laughs> Ooh, is Thomas going to be able to keep in character the entire time? Probably not. <laughs> I mean, totally. <laughs> mm. So yeah, we're going to do it, but not alone, because that would be just pitiful. We're going to be joined by nine of Thomas's real life friends. I put quotes around friends because can Thomas really be sure they're actually his friends? Can any of us really know who is and is not our friend? I'm deep. <laughs> You're probably asking yourself, wow, how can Janice play with a bunch of real-life friends of Thomas's? Well, all of this isn't canon. I'm playing a character, and don't think about it too much. Alright, so I have to do this computer thing. I don't understand computers because I'm not a nerd. I'm gonna try this one more time, but it, it keeps rejecting the name Janice. So apparently I couldn't be Janice. I guess they thought I was saying J-anus. So I have to go with the more subpar version. Stupid. All right, we're in. There aren't any murders yet, and I'm terribly bored. Literally no murders yet. I'm bored. Is Where are the tasks? I just want to push that button just to feel something. All right, so let's see here. What does this, what does this platform do? Does it do anything? I'm not three foot six. Pitiful height. Janice both did body scan. I was doing a body scan. I am totally, totally innocent. Who is okay. an imposter? It turns out I'm very good at this. As everyone can see, I'm still alive because I'm clearly the best at this game. Oh. Emergency meeting. Every Sandersides episode ever. Yeah, I was just rusty. 
and I had to figure out how to get that button pressed. It wasn't working. Yeah, I really took advantage of the fact that you're not a seasoned gamer. Okay, because... nerd. Look at these. Look at these fun trinkets of a bookshelf. He hasn't read a single one of these books. <laughs> oh, look at this large group of people that are afraid of dying so they congregate together. Have you ever seen a Scooby-Doo episode? We split up! Okay, I may or may not have just learned that everyone has specific tasks that they do. I know that in a very early episode of Sandersides, back when they were making them every single week, Patton had desired to do a Let's Play channel, and uh, all I have to say to that is, haha, Patton got here first. No, I'm just playing every single game that you wish that you could play, Patton. But I can give you all a sample of what that might have been. Oh my gosh, we're playing Among Us! Oh, rainbows, sunshine, and lollipops. I don't like killing or lying. It basically would be something like that. <sighs> Looks like somebody took me out, and not in a fun way. So I get to still do these stupid tasks in death. This is great. This is such a fun game. I understand why it's become a national craze. Did I tell you? What did I tell you? What did I say? You were right. I was right! Maria and I was slicing at the same time. Now you'll know to believe me. Any time I throw an accusation anywhere. You know how old the Coca-Cola in those Dear Evan Hansen bottles must be? Like if you had put a penny in them, they'd be completely dissolved. That's real Coca-Cola in there. Gross. <laughs> Y'all need to stop believing Davi. Davi, I know that you're a hardcore me stan, and you're definitely showing me up. Is it okay that I'm fully eating during this? So you... <laughs> sure, sure, Terrence. The sus stands for sustenance. Oh my god! Alright, here we go. Stop following me. Gotta go behind you. Oh, oh. I vote for Jen. Vote for me, please. You all are so out of your depth. You guys really let me get away with a lot here. You really do. I mean, I know that I'm the literal embodiment of deceit, but come on. Oh, you all are thespians, that's right. I'm not a thespian, I'm Kenny. Oh, oh, no. All right, here we go. A little task. Oh no, I hope I don't die. Oh, girl, I was so confused. No, uh, gotta go over here. Uh oh. I don't have anything else to really defend myself in this matter. I was literally just walking through. And again, I wish that I was the imposter. That's what a killer would say. Oh, that being well, said, I skipped. You better be a good boy still. I always am. Kenny is a busy father. So am I. Why do you think I would ever want to expose anyone to blatant murder, including my bastard? What is the name of your bastard anyway? I, I don't need to think of a name. I'll call you Jake. Just go on without me. You don't need me in your life. I'm just trying to get away from my responsibilities. Well, Jan is as suspicious as Dobby, right is this yes, another yes, one of the the, the strategies that you are using to try and take the suspicion off of no. you? No, no, you know why? Because I have a visual task. I have trash. Anybody can watch me do it. I saved it just in case. So are visual tasks off? Are they? Seems like it's not really adding up, Dobby. Okay. That's fine. I have trash. I'm a little trash boy. You can see me take the trash out. Dobby, you've disappointed us one too many times. I'm sorry. Oh. Okay. Okay. Well, that's not. That's not right. The day is mine. It's finally happened. Faria was definitely the silent champ in that game. I was taking all the heat off of Faria and just letting Faria just absolutely kill. This time, Dobby was yep. telling the truth. Moral of the story: respect the trash man. No, moral of the story is don't cry innocent so many times <laughs> and be the imposter, <laughs> Dobby, because it worked against you at long last. <laughs> I feel like a spirit reborn. That was so <laughs> wonderful. I must say, that was actually very fun, and I'm glad that I finally got to be the imposter at the very end. Thank you all so much for joining me, all of you Thomas's friends. You're all way more entertaining than I thought that you actually were. 
I'll take thank it. Thank you, Janice. <laughs> yeah, thanks. Until next time, take it sleazy, guys, gals, and non-binary pals. Peace, Peace out. Peace out. They have made him. I have traveled far and wide only to seek you out to humbly ask, is your friend single? Because he is a snack. <laughs> when I was a young boy, my father took me into the city to see a marching band. He said, son, when you grow up, would you be the savior of the broken, the beaten and the damned? People, children, children, people keep them dying. Children, children, people, children, people, children, people, children, people, people dying. People, children, keep on dying. Pilgrim, keep on children, keep on dying. Pilgrim, keep. People, people, children, keep. Children, people. People, children. Children, people, keep. People, keep on dying. Children, keep on dying. People keep on dying. What the hell? Children peep. Children. Do you practice what you preach? Can't the future just wait? Can't the deadlines come fashionably late? I could push every goal back, take control back. If they'd roll back the rate at which time starts to fly. Never landing or standing by, never taking a break, ever making me retry. We nickel and dime every quarter to two. But maybe it's time to let time pass through. Okay, your digital media teacher is away, but he has told me that your assignment is to play Minecraft or whatever it is you think I don't see you doing every other day. All right, your Spanish teacher has told me to let you continue watching Finding Nemo, which is a VHS tape dubbed in French. Okay, your English teacher told me to just let you play with this raggedy doll that she found in the street yesterday? Okay, your math teacher has instructed you to take a nap and try to dream about numbers. Yeah. Episode. <laughs> All right, Great crew! Great. Ooh, oh. I don't know what I just did there, but that was pretty darn cool. Oh. Boop. <laughs> um, oh, that was cute. That was a tower. Boop. Oh, did you do it? Wait, tower? Yeah, you had like your tower pop up and smack me. Oh my gosh. Um, I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh, what did I just do? I don't know, but it was really cool. Oh! <gasps> oh! <laughs> oh my God. That was really cool. Sorry, I'm sitting. I'm taking a break. Okay. All right, back in. <laughs> Give me my special move! No, I'm boop, 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 boop. Ah! Yes, I will pound you with poetry, much like any poetry slam. No. Chalk <laughs> in here, buddy! Hey, boop, 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 boop. Boop, boop. Can I ask Ooh. you a question? <laughs> no, you cannot. I don't. I couldn't figure out another one. <laughs> <laughs> boop, oh, boop. oh no, okay. The hands out with the Bibles. That's so cool. <laughs> I love that. Uh, and I also need to figure out how to make the sword. Oh, did you see the sword of the stone yeah. man? Oh, I'm learning so much. Oh, oh my gosh, shit. get ready now. Oh, it's no. it's over for you. Thomas Wait, how did we all combo. heal up again? It's you. You're healing us up with your self-care okay, power. Stop doing it. <laughs> play because, you know, Patton really wanted to have like a, a Let's Play series during the MI original. Wow, I am bad at this game. And so. I'm gonna be Remus and beat the out of you. Oh Here. dear. <laughs> I'm gonna beat your booty. That's not good. Why am I going like country? That. He was Woody at one point. Or oh, I'm in. Oh, like Remus, I, I, I look like you. Oh, this is exciting. Look, we're in the mall scene for, for the flirting. The yep. flirting episode. Look, there's Nico there. Oh my gosh. Wait, is that you guys in a garbage can? I knew this was a bad idea. Oh my gosh. Did I just freaking summon confetti? 
I'm fighting with Cthulhu. <laughs> you look like Homaeda from Danganronpa. Oh, well, I'm sure that that is a compliment. Yeah. Boop, boop, boop. I'm, I'm gonna kiss. You. I'm gonna kiss you with with little kisses, Remus. Oh. I'm gonna beat your. Stop! <laughs> stop stabbing me with tentacles. I'm sorry. I got a big stick and I gotta use it. You are absolutely destroying yeah. me right now. Can I fight with my my sweater? Is that what just oh happened there? God. I'm gonna sit on you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit gonna on your you. face. I'm gonna get you. Nico is immediately rethinking everything that he saw in Thomas. <laughs> boop, boop, boop. Let me summon a bunch of confetti. You like my tentacles? <gasps> Expecting the lily pattern. Dude, this is the best time I have had in a long time. 10 out of 10 stars with that frog attack. Frogger! Oh, what did I just pick up? I just picked up. Oh, he has a card. Oh my God. He can pick up the card. I'm so bad at playing in character. I like the long range attacks. That's. Oh, I gotcha, kiddo. Hey, you freaking kill me! You guys like the ending screen is like, oh, he's got a cookie. Oh. He had a cookie. I love that. Boop boop. Um, yeah, look at that mace. Morningstar, I mean. I, got, I always get those mixed up, you know? Oh. Your long range attack is I not do. fair. I'm going to drown you in kisses! No, you're like a smash player. <laughs> I know. The same one over and over. I love him summoning confetti and just going, and release hell. <laughs> I want to be slimy and wet. Okay, I I really immediately regret. Look, you're fighting you. Look at this. Look at look at Thomas in the trash can over here. Oh, uh, yay! Oh, not. I threw a football from the game day tips video. <laughs> I was always more of a thrower than a catcher. That's amazing. Oh this, there's so much here to unpack. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you threw mice at me? Oh this is the special move. I'm gonna do <gasps> umbrella <gasps> with kitties! Kitties! I love it. I love it. And then this is, oh, time over. Oh, you oh won. I won. That deserves a second cookie. I want him to do like a final move like, <laughs> that deserves a second cookie. See, two cookies. <laughs> I hope I got a different palette. Yes! Oh! I loved the unicorn onesie. Look at this, he's just like, <laughs> yeah, he's deflecting whatever. with a book. He's like, Ugh, whatever. Mm. Back in the mall. <gasps> I Whoa. like you got you got season one, Virgil. So look at that graph I just summoned. You're Dotson! <laughs> he looked upset when he hit you. Like oh. it was just like, <gasps> oh really? Yeah. Oh, he doesn't I love like the to little fight. freaking kick. <laughs> oh my gosh, he has like, a scythe. I'm gonna take you out, Logan. Boop, boop, boop. Nope, nope. Yeah. Taste my note cards. <gasps> oh, space! Oh my gosh, space! This is the best thing ever. You're really good at this. Oh, I'm... there was a good little circle chart. I'm gonna kick your ass, Logan. Logan. I mean, Virgil. <laughs> I was, Not so smart. I was, talking, I, was, I was talking to myself. I was like, Logan, <laughs> you need to calm down. All right, <laughs> this is important to get just right. Uh, oh, I'm one space over. No. Oh, whoa. Get on. That was. <laughs> get on, Logan. Oh my God. I knew it was gonna be that. It was a backwards falsehood, but I loved it. You loved it. Oh, oh I healed my this God. again. Falsehood. <laughs> That's so cool. You don't have to yell, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just sitting, just sitting and contemplating that falsehood took a lot out of me. <laughs> Wait, what does my suit look like? Ow. Ow. Ow, ow. Stop it. Yeah. Virgil, can't touch I'm this. going to throw Dana, more Dana, note cards at Dana, you. Dana, can't touch this. Can you, ow. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you are. Oh! Yeah, finally, I got you! Oh, we, just jam we looked at the stats before we played this game. Yeah. And Logan is the most powered. Like, he has this, the highest strength. Yes, Logan out of is it. swole. <laughs> and it's showing right now. His range is not the best, which is why I have to do all these close up moves. But, and then Virgil has like great range. Jeez. We hit something no! again. Uh, you want to call it draw? Yeah. Next time, Virgil. Next time. We'll settle this. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> whatever. I, I think, don't care. I anyways. think we fought very valiantly. Tinder. A couple shots. Put it on Roman's tab. Make a three. Dinah, how you been? What the cat dragged in? I haven't seen you since the split. How you
you holding up, Quinn? Fantabulous and fabulous, full steam ahead. Then it's a cry and shame that my boss wants you dead. What else is new? But without your ex's protection, he'll peel that pretty face off for his private collection. Oh, so now you belong to Mr. Roman Sionis? That spoiled rich dick who only wishes he owned this. Except what is this? What? Who left all their dice out? What kind of die is this? Something has awoken within me. Hello, demons. It's your boy. Long day of shooting, but it was awesome. Um, I probably said this before, but like Remus is wild. Remus is Remus just does some things. <laughs> Hey there, kiddo! It's Father's Day once again, and once again, if you need it, call me Mary, because this Mary Pop is poppin's in on you to be your stand-in papa. Can you hear me? Because I don't know if this is actually recording. Well, we're gonna hope for the best. Anyway, this year was a lot. I know that I struggled, and maybe you did too. Maybe you're dealing with stress or pressure, or maybe you feel bad because you didn't accomplish as much as you would have liked to this past year. Or maybe you're feeling bad due to other circumstances out of your control. I need you to know that you have every right to feel happy and proud of the things you were able to accomplish this past year, despite everything going on in the world. Believe it or not, you do have people out there who love and appreciate you for exactly who you are. And at the very least, I'm proud of you for just getting here to this point through that storm because that is an amazing feat in and of itself and I can't wait to see the amazing things you do in the future. If this past year was any proof, you are capable of great things. I love you and I wish you all the best. Remember, any progress is progress. Be safe and take care. Now, I, I'd ramble on, but I gotta upload this vid to Twitter.com before my, my phone dies. You know, why didn't they call iPhone chargers apple juice? It's just a missed opportunity. Wait. Is Toy Story a play off of Toy Store, but it's just changed to story? Is that, did I just get that? Yes. Uh, which, which Sanders side are you? <laughs> <laughs>